Welcome back. We're ending the show today with Corey Signer from Fisherman's Market. I love ending the show with you. It's yeah, great. They, they say the best for last. That's they what Mark, do. That's what Marcel right? told me to make me feel better. Is that what he said? Yeah. Well, we do like to end the show with you. It is fun. It's a bang. <laughs> How are you? Good. Yeah, always good. Really well. <laughs> we're cooking up sturgeon today. Yeah, we're making sturgeon. It's, uh, and people, you hear sturgeon, people go, ah, sturgeon. They think about those big, yeah, huge fish, right? They're, they're monsters. They're dinosaurs. They're, they're ancient. Uh, this stuff is not, uh, you can't, uh, you can catch sturgeon, but it's catch and release. So okay. there's a lot of places on the coast you can go and, right. and catch sturgeon. You see the big giant sturgeon and stuff. Uh, yes. This is a farm product. Um, now, when people hear farm too and, and they go, oh, farm fish and, and stuff, this is a company called Target Marine. It's out of Seashelt, state of the art facility. I mean, top, top notch. These guys invested a lot of money. Uh, the caviar, obviously, they make caviar is, is kind of their main production. And then what they do with their male stock is they harvest them. Uh, obviously for, for retailers like us to be able to, to cut them up and, and serve them in our shops. Let's so, talk about this. Oh, Can we get a close-up of this, Yeah, that's, that is Northern Divine Caviar. Right. Uh, award, like, world-renowned, award-winning caviar from the sturgeon uh, seashell. Um, it is unbelievable. I don't know a ton about caviar or the process. I'm not a caviar guy. I know that I've eaten a ton of that stuff. Do you like it? Good. Oh, it's delicious. It's unbelievable. It's, it's some of the best caviar I've had. Um, outside some of the, the Russian beluga and stuff like that. But. So sturgeons are really captured first for this product, and then, of course, secondary, but still very good, to is the, the, totally. the meat. Captured in, in, like the, in the Caspian Sea and stuff like that, like in, in, or in Russia and stuff like that, they still uh, capture or catch these for the sturgeon. But okay. here they're farmed. Okay. Uh, they're, they're actually like, they, they put zippers into the female stock, they unzip the caviar out and stuff like that. They so it's put a, zippers into the fish? Yeah, they're, yeah, they're, they're zippers, so they unzip them and they have the caviar out, so they, they you know, zippers? the females stay alive. Um, and then the male stock they produce into the meat, so we cut them in the shop and we put it out. Mm -hmm. um, super tender, mm -hmm. unbelievable. Mm -hmm. If you're a big halibut fan, I find this to be a meatier than halibut. Really? And just the flavor. And I mean, if uh, you, you can see it here, and I'm sure Marcel will get a close up um, when he has a chance, but it's fatty, it's marbled. You actually age the fish whole, like beef. It takes a week like to break down because it's so fatty. Uh, so these big fat lines break down and you cook it. I made it last night, melt in your mouth. Delish. Un oh, it's an amazing, unbelievable product. Uh, so today we're gonna cook, we're doing sturgeon, and I'm doing it with a mushroom and thyme sauce. Again, like my meal last night was awesome. so unbelievable. Um, so why are we doing sturgeon? Mm -hmm. um, next week, and again, people see the cooking show and they come into the shop right away. Mm -hmm. and they're like, ah, I want what he was making. Uh, it'll be Tuesday. Tuesday to Sunday next week, the Fisherman's Market, all locations, is launching their, their sturgeon. So we're awesome. launching it. We're going to have a smoked sturgeon, the caviar. We're going to have sturgeon fillets, uh, all for great pricing to get, you know, we want to introduce it in the market. As a, especially in the off-season when halibut shuts down, this is a great substitute, and it's fresh, it's local, it's organic. Again, Target Marine, take a look at it. The farming process is just unbelievable and impeccable, and it's one of those things you can eat and just feel good about. Mm -hmm. swear, you're good, you're I, good. I swear to you. You didn't burn it. I know you think you did. I got to defend myself a little bit because it's like the elements here and stuff. I grew this at home. It was mint. It was cherry last night. It was beautiful. Was it? And, oh, absolutely. It's our elements. So, <laughs> so we're talking sturgeon. One of the big things why we're doing sturgeon is sustainability month at the fisherman's market. Mm -hmm. uh, sustainability is something we take super seriously. Mm -hmm. It's a huge thing. Making sure we have fish year after year after year is so important. So all the fish featured in the store this month is um, sustainable. Awesome. Like every single thing, um, Arctic char, we got wild albacore tuna, we got the whole, the whole gambit. We're doing a whole albacore tuna sale. Buy the whole fish, we, you get loins, great deal, the whole nine's albacore nice. tuna. It Sashimi. smells good, I'll tell you that. Oh, this is delicious. Oh, it's, oh, it's absolutely. We have about three minutes. Do you I think we can minutes. do this? I know. I'm good. I'm gonna make this work in three minutes. Really? Because there's a lot of stuff going on over here. I'm gonna start it right now. I'm okay. not even worried. I'm actually, I like to leave it to the last minute just to like rush so I can like, get all nervous and okay, stuff. Okay, sure. So anyway, sustainability, hold on. I'm gonna pull this out. We're gonna plate that. Um, sturgeon is very versatile. So when you're cooking with it, mm -hmm. you can, uh, you don't have to be as careful. Like with a halibut, you really wanna get that halibut bang on. Yes. With sturgeon, like I cooked it, I thought I overcooked it last night. Right. And it was still like melt in your mouth. I probably could have cooked it a little longer. So it's pretty forgiving. Super, oh, super forgiving. Like okay. barbecue, oh, if you're barbecuing, it's unbelievable. Um, so we've got shiitake mushrooms in our pot, pan, powder pan. I got some crumini mushrooms, we got some shallots, and we're just gonna saute these off. 
Maybe I, I'm gonna run out of time. Do you think? Are you feeling stressed? You know, I don't get, I don't get stressed out. First and foremost, I'm showcasing the item. I'm right. showcasing like today's sustainability, what's going on in our market, some beautiful fish that everybody can try. You know, I want to promote seafood. I want to promote sustainability to as many people as I can. Mm -hmm. Whether or not you finish the cooking segments. Whether, yeah, like, you know, get, get, you know, you get David Toons on here from Terra, you get Chef Romeo on here. Those guys can cook. You know, like Mitt's Kitchen, you've been you down there. You can cook, you do a great I, job. I'm okay, we're actually in Vancouver. Uh, next week we are doing a uh, plated meal and I will be cooking that nice. uh, for Margaret Trudeau. Uh, no for way. ovarian cancer. Yeah, we've actually fed Margaret oh, yeah. Trudeau three times in three different places on her tour through the West Coast uh, for her ovarian cancer Great. Um, yes. thing that she's doing. Yeah, no, it's totally cool. So nice. we got fresh thyme going into the pan. And again, we're just going to saute this down. I'm not getting the signal yet from Marcel, so it looks like I've got time. Mm -hmm. We'll probably have about a minute and a half. Are you, a, uh, are you an Albacore two tuna minutes. fan? Oh, Do you we like have two sushi? The show? We have one minute left All right, this uh, is to finish this. I love sushi, of course. Oh, you do? Yeah. Everybody, everybody loves sushi. Albacore tuna. Everybody comes in the shop and they see like the red al ahi tuna. Mm -hmm. Albacore tuna off our coast. It is the best sashimi, highest oil content. Melt in your mouth. The stuff that we have in the stores right now is just unbelievable. We're gonna deglaze our pan a little bit here. We got some uh, chicken stock and just a splash of white wine. Nice. And we're gonna reduce this down. And it's gonna be done in 30 seconds and it's gonna be amazing. Oh, everything we sell that's sustainable in our shops this month, we're donating a whole, uh, a whole whack of it, a whole portion of it to the OceanWise. Um, Good for you guys. OceanWise Vancouver Aquarium. Uh, they're kind of like, they found it on the West Coast, sustainable fishing practices. Mm -hmm. They seek out sustainable fisheries all over the world. It smells good, right? Oh my goodness, that white wine, that's what do it, it's doing it for so me. Get, yeah, fish. you're doing it at home, right? You cook your fish, you know, you reduce this down. Super simple to make, it's super good. I hit it with a little bit of butter. Super duper out of time. Oh, Marcel, right am I done? Marcel's gonna start giving us the Is Marcel gonna wine. yell at me? All right, well, this is just gonna go on the fish. Okay. All right. Here's Sorry, the Marcel. We'll come back for the goodbye. You'll be on the goodbye with me. I'll be on the goodbye, nice. Yeah, so here it is. Uh, for tomorrow, a few clouds in the caribou. Most areas will see a very pleasant mix of sun and clouds, and each day is going to get warmer as we go. Tomorrow in the Shushwap, 16 mix of sun and clouds, and in Kamloops, tomorrow, 19 mix of sun and clouds. Inquiry board, cfjctoday.com. You can go there to see what's coming up on the show next week. Let's get this done. We have 20 seconds. Okay, it's on. Fisherman's Market, shop sustainably. Come on down, get some sustainable seafood on your plate today. And we got some mushrooms, we got some shallots, we got a beautiful sauce. Beautiful. On, on asparagus. Awesome. And there it is. Have That's a, a good looking meal. Targa Marine, check it out. Northern Divine Caviar, unbelievable. Have a great day, everybody. Have a great weekend. We'll see you back here on Monday. Bye for now.